Yo, yo, so today we'll be making a tier list of the most best plugin to the worst so you can choose what works best for you and which should you download. I'll be giving my personal opinion, unbiased, so you can really see what plugin you should download and start with. So in here, firstly, I have BCC, Surveillance, Video Go Pilot, FX Console, Six Us 2, Trap Go Suite, Magic Bullet, Saber, MXM, Sapphire, Mocha Pro, Signal, RSMB, Element 3D, Universe, Deep Glow, Twitch, Trickster, and VFX Switch. So if you don't already know, these are all the like the main plugins which you need, and I'm going to list them. So firstly, starting off with BCC, this package comes with hella effect. I guess it has more than 500 or a thousand effects on it, which is actually crazy. But the thing is with this BCC is it is mainly used on like anime edits as much as i seen and used because i don't really end up using it on like music video that much so i guess i'm gonna tear it around c or b let's just go with b because the plugin is really great if you like on the right niche and you can find a really great use of it and also has a great library of effects to choose through and the next one is surveillance yo this is an interesting one if you don't already know so Surveillance is a plugin which is by Tiny Tips, who is also a creator. And the UI of this plugin starting off is really crazy. I really love the way that he made it. And also the functionality of this extension slash plugin is really great. You can add like those grungy effects and it comes with preset and you can like play with all the presets and stuff and create your own as well as much as I know. So the use cases of this plugin is a bit low no offense but it's a bit low because if you like compare it with like a sick or something like that the use cases is a bit low but everything about this plugin is really great man like the effects the greens and all of the stuff he put it a lot of work on it really a great plugin so i'm gonna rank it at a for now could have been an s but let's just keep it at a if you want to download this surveillance i'll leave it in the description it's not like sponsored or anything it's just a affiliate link you can also use my code to get a bit of discount which is really cool but anyways moving on we have fx console man this plugin is a banger bro if you don't already know this is not like a fx or something like that but helps you with the workflow of applying fx so if i like hit like control enter on my keyboard it will bring like a new pop-up where i can search up my fx on so that's really great and plus it is free which i love so our first st plugin will be video copilot fx console for sure moving on we have six us 2 plugin really like push the bars i feel like because after six us 1 you had like some limitation on it so in six us 2 the ui is really crazy as well it is much more better than six us 1 and the features are insane bro you can really make your own preset files or sell them or you can give it out for free you can use it on your own project you can make your own say it has flickers it has motion blur controls it has scale controls it has rotation controls so this is easily an s tier plugin and it's also available for free trial which is the best thing of it i'll leave this in the description so you can start your free trial for free and you can cancel anytime when you like but really a great plugin brand killed it then we have trap core suite so this is really an interesting one too because i don't really end up using it that much but the possibilities with this plugin is insane as well like i saw people creating like water simulation in after effects using trap code so the possibilities are endless with this so when it comes to like particle simulation physics and stuff it really kills but here's the interesting part the use cases are really low of trap code suite on a music video especially in music video i'm not i'm not considering all those movie effects and stuff but in music video the use cases are really low because what are the chances that 
that you need physics or simulation for your music video also you can straight up use a free program called blender to do it if you really want to so just because of the use cases i will rank it on c could have been a b as well but just because of the use cases i will leave it at c and again these are just my personal preferences on this plugin and how i feel about them so you can comment down below your opinions and if i messed up some ranking and stuff so you can let me know in the description now next on the list we have magic bullet switch this is really a great plugin if you don't already know this allows you to add those cinematic film grades to your music videos and help guide you to get the best color best range as well and everything about it is really great also its lens flare are really good the atmospheric flares that it has it's really great so i think i'll rank it on a eight tier. if you like doing a big budget music video this can be really helpful on the color grading part so surely an a plugin for sure now we have saber this is an interesting one as well because it is like the effect that you see on star wars and stuff with like those energy beams or like those energy lines you can call so it's a free plugin again it makes it goated but i really feel like this is like a bit overused like with universe ecto also this is kind of overused in my opinion and also the use cases of this is really low because what are the chances you need uh, like a laser effect on it so i guess i will leave it on d for now this might be a bit controversial you might have your own opinions on sapphire but let's just leave it at d for now just because it's like a bit overused and the use cases are low as well now we have mxm so this is surely an s tier plugin because this is a revolution when it comes to digital mixed media because from ages people been trying to figure out the easiest way to do mixed media with the look of the original and in that case mxm plugin really comes in a clutch it really allows you to get that authentic mixed media look just digitally within after effects with few clicks and the ui of this plugin is really great as well so shortly an s tier plugin i will highly recommend i'll link it in the description if you want to download this as well with my discount code so you can use that but really great plugin freight pele absolutely killed it now we have sapphire the goated plugin ever it comes with a lot of effects like bcc but it is really usable with music video which makes them super cool and all the plugins are customizable on your own way so solely an s tier plugin but it has a crashing problem that a lot of people face is like when you editing a 4k video with sapphire on it it's really gonna crash like five to six time or even 10 times sometimes so you gotta really see the arrangement of effects on sapphire because if you combine different effects from sapphire together it will surely crash so that's the one thing to keep in mind when using sapphire but it's a surely or s tier for sure man i really feel like sapphire has the cult fan following for sure so now we have mocha pro this is really a great plugin when it comes to like tracking the mesh tracking of this is really insane if you haven't already saw which allows you to add those like tattoos and stuff in your skin easily within after effects but again the use cases of this plugin is a bit because what are the chances you need like mesh tracking for your music video so again i'll rank it on the c tier just because the use cases of this plugin on a music video is a bit low now we have signal so signal is really the clutch when it comes to like vhs and those like synth effects but with signal i really feel like the use cases are a bit high because the chances of you needing like a signal plugin to create those vhs effects are a lot higher so definitely a uh, a tier for me now we have rsmb so let's just put it at s and let's talk about it if you don't already know rsmb is the plugin which allows you to add those smooth motion blur for your music videos and any type of videos that you're working on if you're doing like any type of effects and you apply rsmb on top it will surely look better so it is like a goated plugin in my opinion and a lot of people like it as well it's it's really like the essential plugin and also it is really fast and uses gpu so that's really great as well so definitely a s tier plugin now we have universe so universe 
Kanye voice is a bit controversial as well because a lot of people like it and a lot of people don't like it as well. But I'm the guy who uses Universe but not that much as Sapphire or other plugin on SGA. So I'll rank it around B or A. Let's just put it on A for now just because the effects on Universe I really feel like it's really a bit old fashioned and they are a lot less effect as compared to Sapphire and the usable effects on those are like 2 or 3 only. So could have been also been an B tier plugin but let's just put it at A cause it's been the OZ plugin for music videos. Now we have Element 3D. So let's just put it as top firstly for sure like right beside Sapphire cause Element 3D allows you to add 3D objects which is really crazy for after effects because in the past you won't be able to like import 3d models on your on your after effects project now with element 3d it's really great the replicator effects are really insane on it and also the render system is really fast the shadows the lighting everything like the ambient occlusion box depth maps everything we want like custom layers custom textures like it's the goaded plugin made by video called pilot oz creator if you don't already know so highly recommend it anyone starting out using that plugin i also have my pack which is the 3d title bundle which comes with my 3d title preset and my 3d title pack together which uses the power of element 3d to create insane 3d titles for your music video so i'll link it in the description if you want to download the pack as well but now moving on to our next plugin which is deep glow this can be a controversial opinion as well again because this is one of the favorite effects of people in after effects almost everybody has it and it really gives that vibrant glow that we want which after effects really fails doing it so it's really like a s tier plugin but just because i like optical glow more than deep glow i'm gonna put it at a yes sir i'm gonna put it at a i know some people will be mad at me for putting deep glow at a but it is what it is because optical glow is a bit better i feel like than deep glow and it's smooth as deep glow as well so deep glow deserves it a i feel like right now now coming to twitch twitch is a plugin which i don't really use that often but it's really cool for like those anime edits again but i don't think it is mainly mainly used for like music videos so a really great plugin again but just because of the use cases are really low and i really feel like this plugin is a bit old style in my opinion i don't know why so i'm gonna put it at f at now i know a lot of people would disagree with this decision but you really gotta think bro unless you are like an anime editor it's not that useful i feel like but that's just my opinion so now we have Quickster, really great plugin again, which allows you to add those crazy slow-mos, definitely a useful plugin, so, so for now I think I'm gonna rank it at B tier, just because it can be replaceable with the normal flame blending effect, so that's why it's on B, but it is easily in S if you use it right. Now moving on, we have VFX Suite, so this is a great plugin again, which deserves a bit higher speed space i feel like so let's just rank it on a for now just just because it has deep glow which is one of the best glow for after effects and a bit better version of deep glow and it also comes with bank plugin which allows you to add those muzzle flash in 3d space and also chromatic displacement which is really goaded for sure so finally here's the tier list right here i ranked all the plugins that were fan favorites and give my own opinion on it you can see i uh, in the S, I have Sapphire, Element, FX Consoles, XS2, MXM, and RSMB. And in A is Surveillance, Magic Bullet Switch, Signals, Universe, and Deep Glow, and VFX Switch. Then in B, we have BCC, 
with Twixter and in C we have Trap Code Suite with Mocha Pro then in D we have Saver and in F we have Twitch so that's my personal ranking right there let me know if this ranking satisfies your opinions or you can also let me know which rank you disagree with so that's the tier list right there so that's it for today's video guys so if you like this video please hit the like button this wasn't like a tutorial but it was a, like a fun video so i hope you like it if you want more comment down below and let me know so yeah see you in the next video peace